Dino 1.29, released December 14th, comes with big updates to the Redevel print loop, including NPM compatibility, and much, much more. You can now use NPM specifiers in the REAP. Like other Dino subcommands, no separate installation step is needed. Import a package and you're good to go. Dino's REAP is now secure by default. Like the rest of Dino, the REAP now runs with no permissions by default. Permissions are specified using allow flags or the permission prompt when needed. Dino init is now more helpful. In addition to the main and test modules, init now generates two additional files. A Dino config to help your IDE discover the Dino project, and a main bench file so you can run benchmarks. Additional updates include improvements to NPM compatibility, developer experience, and a whole lot more. For the entire list of updates, check out the official Dino blog post. For updates on new releases and announcements, subscribe to our YouTube channel, join our friendly Discord server, or follow us on Twitter. Thanks for watching!